Hi, in this video we'll see how to fix the error dot charge locking is not working properly. Dot charge is a useful method to pay using dot for crossing in UK. Sometimes user might face some of the login problems where they are not able to log in to the account and there are some reasons like why it's not working we also see some of the solutions so that we can resolve them in this article we will explain the common causes of the login issues and guide on how you can fix them efficiently okay so why dot charge is not working we'll see and we also see like how we can fix that particular problem if you are having a trouble with the dot chart login then there could be some of the reasons for it and one of the common reason is entering the login entering the wrong login credentials sometimes you have missed to enter the correct login details whether it can be username or it can be a password okay another possibility is is that there could be some kind of technicality issues such as some of the internet connection which can affect the login process okay at the times the caches and cookies stored in your browser can also be become corrected and can be causing the issues for your login process okay so additionally browser extensions such as ad blockers may interfere uh, with the website functionality and can cause the login issues Luckily, we are able to find some of the solutions that could help you to fix this particular issue. Okay, if these workarounds do not resolve the problem, then it is recommended that you can contact the support team for further assistance. Okay, so we'll see some of the methods like where you can follow in order to fix this issue. Okay, the method number one is check your internet connection. So before making any kind of any other adjustments or any other uh, finding the solution, check your internet connection. Ensure that you have a proper internet connection with a very good speed and a very good bandwidth. Okay. If you feel that you don't have any problem with the internet connection, just check with the router or the modem. Okay. So what you can do is like you can just switch off or switch on your router or a modem. You can wait for some you can wait for some seconds then you can turn it back on so okay so if the problem still persists reset your network settings on your device go to the network settings menu on your system and look for the option to reset or restart the network settings so you can also try connecting your device to different wi-fi network or you can switch your cellular data network to see if the issue is specific to your network. Just imagine that you are using some of the broadband or the Wi-Fi internet connection. So what you can do is like anyhow you will be having a smartphone or a cell phone. You can connect your cell phone to the system through the Wi-Fi. Check whether the problem is with the broadband connection or with the uh, system. Okay, so if possible, try connecting the internet using the different device such as smartphone or a tablet to see if the issue is specific to your device. Okay, so that's the first method. And the second method is wait for some time, then again try later. Okay, this is one of the simplest solution. There can be some kind of maintenance or the downtime with respect to the server. So what you can do is like you can wait for some time okay then probably you can try after some time there are some cases like there can be some server issues with the dot charge that is going on some kind of maintenance of the issue or some kind of technical problems okay if the server is down for some time then the best thing is to wait for some time then you can try again later okay that's the second method the third method is double check your login credentials always make sure that you are entering a correct username and the password okay so that you will not face these kind of issues okay 
and that's the third and the fourth method is delete the caches and cookies in your browser suppose if you are using a google chrome go to the last three dots click on the history so here you can click on history and here you can click on clear browsing data so here you can select all time then here you can click on clear the data okay so once you clear once you click on that all the cookies and caches will be removed from your web browser if you are using a chrome okay there are certain steps which you need to follow if you are using a mozilla firefox or if you are using a safari or microsoft edge that's the fourth method the fifth method is temporarily disable the extension if you are still facing the problem consider disabling the browser extensions temporarily some extensions like ad blocker might pay, might interfere with the login process causing the disruptions here are the some of the steps to disable the extension open your web browser access the extensions or uh, add on sections locate the extensions you want to disable turn off the extensions using the provided toggle check box or a button test dot charge login to check if the issue is resolved that's the fifth method and the sixth method is try using a different browser or a device suppose you are facing a login problem with the chrome try using a mozilla firefox if you are facing a problem with the mozilla firefox then try with google chrome if you are facing the problem in both the web server web, uh, web browser then you can uh, then you can try in microsoft edge okay then you can try different different web browsers if you are facing the problem that's the sixth method and the seventh method is contact the dot charge support team if the previous methods didn't work you can just click on uh, this dot charge support team website so here you can check uh, you can here you can raise the issue whatever you are facing okay in this particular website here you can uh, see the contact number you can just contact them or you can send a questions or complaint online about the problem what you are facing okay so that's all about this thank you